The name's Matix, Matmatix, Mathematical Secret Agent, licensed to chill. This may look like a quaint French crepery nestling in front of the Big Dipper. It is, in fact, the secret headquarters of Intermath. Matt, help! Ah, there you are, Minnie Pinny, Honey Bunny. Not now, Matix. I'm being. <laughs> Now I have Mini Pinny, you'll be zero, Matix, and she will be my mental maths queen. Matix, do something! Okay. La 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 Something to help me! Don't worry, Mini Pinny, I'll never let you wear Strange Gloves Crown! Nice scream! Minnie Pinny is stuck on the top of the Big Dipper Matics. The only way to save her is to answer questions on comparing numbers. Double O trouble! I know nothing about comparing numbers. Come in, Minnie Pinny. Help! What now, Matics? Tell me what you know about comparing numbers. Uh, when comparing numbers. We can use these signs. This sign means is less than. This sign means is greater than or is more than. This sign means is equal to. The arrowhead always points to the smaller number. Here, the arrow points to 4.25. So it's the smaller number. Here, the arrow points to 1.5. So that's the smaller number. Decimals are easier to compare than fractions. When one of the numbers is a fraction, change it to a decimal to help you compare. One half changed to a decimal is 0.5. Now it's clearer to see that 0.5 is less than 0.6. So the sign needed here should point to the lowest number. Did you get all that, Matix? Hmm. Looks like you'll need help. And that's why I've assigned my special agents to the mission. Program system's working. A-OK. -okay. Agents ready for action. Got them. OK, do your worst, Strange Glove. Wait a minute, Strange Glove. If you're there, who's flying the helicopter? Right, little odd mittens, of course. Mission one, stop the pussy flying the helicopter and save Mini Penny. OK, Strange Glove, that's enough of your game. What do we have to do to save Mini Penny? Let us begin with this. Is this sign true or false? Put a tick if it's true and a cross if it's false. Agents, I need your help. Hmm. Let me see. The arrow should point at the smaller number. Is 0 0.9 smaller than 0 0.75? No, it's bigger. So put a cross. Correct. Beginner's luck, Matix. Try this question. 6 tenths equals 0.6. True or false? When one of the numbers is a fraction, change it to a decimal. 6 tenths as a decimal is 0.6. Now we're comparing one decimal with another. And 0.6 is exactly the same as 0.6. That's true. So put a tick. Enough pussyfooting around! It's time to answer my questions, but with no help. First, work them out in your head, then write a tick if it's true or a cross if it's false. Answer when you hear this sound. You will receive one mark for each correct answer. But you need at least three marks each to save Miss Mini Penny. Question one. True. Or false.
question two. True or false? Question three. True or false? Question five. True or false? And finally, question six. True or false? Now, mark your answers carefully. Question one, true. Question two, true. Question three, false. Question four, false. Question five, false. Question six, true. Give yourselves one mark for each correct answer. Then keep a note of your score. You'll need it later. How many did you get, agents? Then it's au revoir, Mademoiselle Pinny. <laughs> Miss Minnie Pinny! Honey Bunny! Oh, do stop sniveling, Mattox! Minnie Pinny, but. I jumped. Out of the frying pan, into the fire. Mattox, do something! It's all right. I've attached this tracking device to Strange Glove's helicopter. Hmm. No, I haven't. I'm still holding it. Matty! Mission two, find the real Mini Pinny. I followed Strange Glove to this French campsite, but where is his secret headquarters? Aha. It's all right, Miss Mini Pinny. I've got you. Oh, oh, there you are. Are. As you can see, Maddox, multiple mini pinnies. But which are my robots and which is the real mini pinny? I'm Miss Mini Penny. I'm Miss Mini Penny. I'm, I'm Miss Mini Penny. Penny. I'm Miss Mini Penny. No, I am. No, I am. No, I am. No, I am. The only way to find the genuine pinny is to answer my questions on mental calculations with decimals. Special Agents, quick! I need everything you've got on mental calculations with decimals. Adding and subtracting decimals is just like adding and subtracting whole numbers. But you've got to think about where the decimal point goes. Ah, so the decimal points must line up underneath each other. It's the same with subtraction. If you know your number facts up to 20, it shouldn't be too difficult. Just look out for the decimal point. Let's see how much you know. Agents, can you answer this question? Yes, Matt. Adding decimals is just like adding whole numbers, but you've got to think about where the decimal point goes. Nine and three is 12. Don't forget the decimal point. The answer is 1.2. Correct. But what about this question? Subtracting decimals is the same as subtracting whole numbers. 12 minus 6 is 6. Add the decimal point. The answer's 0.6. Don't get the computer. That's enough. You have to answer these questions all by yourselves without any help. First, work them out in your head, then write your answers down when you hear this sound. This time, you will receive two marks for each correct answer, but you need at least six marks each before I reveal the real Miss Penny. Prepare to answer questions on mental calculations with decimals. Question one. Question two.
Question three. Question five. And question six. Now, mark your answers carefully. Question one, 1.3. Question two, 1.4. Question 3, 0.7. Question 4, 0.9. Question 5, 1.4. Question 6, 0.7. Give yourselves two marks for each correct answer and keep a note of your score. You'll need it later. How do we do this time? Well done, Special Agents. I can take it from here. Now then, Strange Glove, reveal the real Miss Minipinny so I can rescue her. Nuts! You'll have to find that for yourself. Remember, it's au revoir, not goodbye. <laughs> rescue me, Matt. I'm Miss Minipinny. No, me. I'm Miss Minipinny. Rescue no, me. 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 No, me. quiet! Me. The only way to find the real Minipinny is to answer this simple question. What does Miss Minipinny always keep with her? <gasps> a clothes calculator, hairbrush, Wellington bag, bicycle top, beard trimmer. No. How about a laser-guided heat-seeking ice cream cornet? <gasps> Miss Minipinny. Matt. <clears throat> Sorry, Mattix. Unfinished business. A laser-guided heat-seeking ice cream comet? I'll be back! Just you wait! In your maths class! In your maths test! I'll be there to stop you! So, Miss Minnie Penny, as I single-handedly rescued you from the clutches of Dr. Strangeglove, I'd say you owe me one. I do owe you one, Mattix. Well, I like it right now. Open wide. <laughs> now, it's time to see how you did. Add your score from Mission 1 to your score from Mission 2. Are you a cadet, special agent, or master spy? And here is your secret mission until next time. The three corner numbers in this triangle total one. So what can the other corner numbers be? Until next time, good luck and goodbye. Oh. Hmm. What flavor was that? It was, this intermath pod will self-destruct in three seconds, flavor. Hmm. Thought I recognized it. 